letter I wrote to the Minister of Foreign Affairs on 9th April, indicating that if by 10th May the ban is not lifted, then we shall have no option but to stage a peaceful demonstration to the embassy here. And indeed, this week we have carried out various meetings with the ambassador and with other stakeholders. And we are convinced that indeed everything is now um, under control. The technicalities that, have, uh, that, are, that led to the denial of Muslims uh, to access visas uh, has been cleared. And we are aware that now what is remaining is just uh, appending the signature on our file. And we believe that sooner than later, uh, the visas will be uh, issued to the Muslims who would like to go for Umrah and visa. And that's why we have informed the ambassador that let this be done in the shortest time possible. In the shortest time possible, because if it is not done within the shortest time possible, then we shall, because we have just suspended our demonstration, so that means that if we wait for a certain period and we don't see anything changing, we don't see anything coming out, uh, giving Ugandans visas, then we shall come and say, yes, we have waited for enough, and then we, let's come and stage our peaceful demonstration. But as of now, we have cancelled, we have suspended our demonstration because we have been convinced by His Excellency the Ambassador that everything is being worked on to ensure that Muslims go for Umrah and Hajj.